Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on what time you're watching this video. Welcome back to another video. Today we have confession. This is confession part one. I hope you like the video, you have subscribed to the channel and watch this video up until the end because it's going to be a very educative um, content. And then we're planning to drop more and more of this video. Just make sure that you stick around and you reach you reach out to us if you have anything to say or to confess we'll also keep your name anonymous so you don't have to send your names and locations when you reach out to us depending on how you feel it today we have a confession i'm going to read it out for you and then we're going to break it down for you and i'm going to give you advices on what i think about the whole situation okay the first confession is confession it goes like i am 28 i think that he's referring to that uh he's a uh, male 28 years i've been in a relationship for two years now with my partner i have cheated and my girlfriend has cheated too okay i believe we have i believe we need some fun in our relationship which is true I think in a relationship you need some fun you can't always be doing the same thing and same thing again and again because the relationship might start to be boring and stuff so you have to be creative and find something that like will bring the will will make the 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 relationship uh yeah you understand I believe we need some fun in our relationship I've been suggesting threesome strictly females candidate okay she agreed i guess that the girlfriend agreed she agreed to find someone but it's been a month now and there's this friend of her has that i would really like to smash first year okay i think we're getting somewhere here and then like i think like uh okay let us continue reading the post before we we, we continue the craving is growing and i'm really and and I'm afraid I might pursue the friend if we don't find a partner soon. So that he means that you might go to her girl, his girlfriend's friend and tell her that uh, we want to do a threesome with you and my girlfriend himself instead of the girlfriend going and tell her friend because the girlfriend is taking too long to do that. Which is fair. Okay. With that being said, I was hoping perhaps we sh I was I was hoping perhaps we could find someone interested among their followers. Okay, <laughs> we are willing to cater for whoever is willing to join us. Thank you. Okay, I think according to me uh, and the, and the advice while I'm looking to this post, I think that. Mm, this guy here already had everything planned out like when he said that he wants his girlfriend's friend to join the relationship on whatsoever that they want to do he had already planned that the first time he saw the friend and then he didn't want to approach her and propose to her that he like he likes her because he's already dating her friend you understand so the agenda was already there before the relationship he thought that the relationship was boring and then this thing he said like strictly females candidates like he wants females candidates to be part of the of the threesome i think it's crazy because like according to me i think this guy is being selfish because if they are doing a threesome if the lady is organizing a female that means you must organize a male and both of them they have already cheated why don't they find the partners that they have cheated with because it seems like there is a bit of interest amongst them you understand so i think it's being selfish if she find a girl that they're going to is going to join for threesome i think like you might you might as well uh find a male candidate to join them to do this thing you understand I think that like, you're being selfish my advice to you is that if you really want to have fun first advice like you can try some new things try dancing dancing on TikTok challenges try uh, going out more often if that's the case if like uh, finance and stuff is not collaborating maybe like you can do other things you can uh, 
you can be creative in any sort of way just to to make to bring that vava boom on your relationship and then the other uh, advice that i'm going to offer is that uh if you think like you guys need a threesome to have fun i think what applies on the male side should also apply on the female side if she getting a girl you must also get a boy because it all seems like uh you pushing your own agenda don't don't forget guys a relationship is not all about one person and it's not about uh, 50 50 in a relationship it's 100 100 if you take a decision she must take a decision because this is what you think and then I don't think it's fair okay let us check the comments what they say on the comments on the comment section they said uh, it will be it will be fair if you suggest for a male candidate too that's what i was saying you choose the friend and she can bring the gents she cheated with so that you can learn some few things i think that's fair that's what i was trying to say if you bring a girl if she brings a, a boy if you, she brings a girl she brings a, a guy so that it will be a balanced equation and then the other comment i say here uh let's check another comment we are willing to cut out whoever is willing to join us thank you bro <laughs> is pushing business the professionalism in it cannot be missed <laughs> okay that's fair okay uh and then one last comment uh this is well structured job description well done fam you have done crazy but your writing and storytelling is impeccable okay i understand the way he put it like the way he put the whole scenario he's thinking for himself he does not uh think for his partner it's all about this relationship it's all about you you understand so try and uh, put your partner in the same situation that you are putting you putting her right now and then make it about her also because the relationship is not about you and that was all the confession part one for today guys i hope you guys re really enjoyed this uh confession and the way i tried to break it down for you just make sure that you subscribe to the channel you like the video this was confession part one i hope you're ready guys for confession part two and then we try all our best to cater and respond to all the confessions and we give you advice that we think that is going to be fair not that it should be based on one person and then the other person so suffer we don't react or we don't give advices only on relationships based stuff but we give relationships on uh in general in every situation that you account so you can reach us out on the the description box below there are going to be links where you can whatsapp us reach out to us we can help you about that and then we can offer you some solutions about it if there are the problem you have uh they need medication they need prayers they need uh anything in general we can help you in that so thank you very much for watching this video guys i hope this video made your day and then i'll see you